I'm going to teach you now how to do a comma stroke angled to the left. We're going to begin the stroke just like the straight stroke at the top, applying pressure, and as we curve and pull that brush towards us, we're going to begin lifting and end up back up on the tip of the brush. So let's try that. We're going to start, apply pressure, I'm going to curve it slightly to the left, and every time I'm doing that, I'm slightly moving and releasing that pressure to end back up on the tip of the stroke, the tip of the brush. Touch, apply pressure, pull, lift, and drag slightly to the left, end back up on the tip of the brush. And that is commonly called a comma stroke. That's angled to the left. Next, I'm going to show you how you can practice your strokes directly on top of mine. This is a printable brush stroke basics guide. You can download and print on your computer. The arrows are indicating, again, we're starting at the top, ending at the bottom. Let's try that stroke. We're going to apply pressure, pull, lift, begin releasing pressure, and back up on the point of the brush. I'm always making sure I have enough paint on my brush. Touch, apply pressure, pull, and end back up on the tip of the brush. Another way you, you can use our brush stroke basics guide is to lay a sheet of artist tracing paper or parchment paper directly on top of the brush stroke guide and practice directly on that tracing paper. And there is one comma stroke to the left. I'm going to refill my brush with paint, touch, apply pressure, pull, lift, and drag back up to the point. Comma strokes to the left are really very, very simple to do. Now let's try a few comma strokes to the right. The comma stroke to the right is done exactly like the left. We're going to start at the top, apply pressure on that brush, begin pulling towards you but curving slightly to the right. The whole time I'm lifting and dragging so that I end up at the point. Let's try that again. Apply pressure, pull, slightly curve to the right. I'm lifting my pressure, I'm releasing the pressure on the brush, lifting it back up to a point. Touch, apply pressure, and back up on the point. And there you go, it's a comma stroke to the right.